Um, got a package here for the um, little budget build, I guess you would call it now, for the, uh, the GMC Jimmy. Um, so we're going to see what it is. Um, I'm going to take it open, open it here, and uh, try to get it on installed. Here we go. So I got a roof rack for the uh, Jimmy. Found it online. I'll put a link in the description here um, for where I got it and all that good stuff. So here's a wind deflector, it looks like, for it. We got, and then here's a box. I think this is probably all the hardware. To install it. We got some fasteners, things of that sort. We've got some hardware, um, hardware to assemble it, I'm going to assume. And then we have directions, and then this is this is a direct aftermarket universal roof rack assembly. Um, I got it on eBay, just like everything else. Um, I think it was like 60 bucks. So, just going to look at this. Doesn't look hard at all to assemble, so I'm going to get together, get working on this thing, and assemble it. shorter bolts from here and I got to look in um, they sent these spacers these little spacers I don't know if you can see that I'm sorry can't really see on the camera but uh, they added these spacers so basically what you have to do is on the bottom you're gonna add a spacer block to space out the diffuser and that'll help with the wind noise um, so I'm gonna put this on here and um, I'll show it to you when I'm done So 
basically these are going to go over top and these are going to mount this to my roof rack. So I'm going to set up the camera over there and I'll continue working on Okay guys, so basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, adjust this. This is probably going to be way off so I'm going to have to adjust these. Um, and there's two tabs here that you can unloosen and it will slide back and forth. Um, I'm going to say it's probably easier said than done. So I'm going to put the uh, mount the rack up here and see where I need to move things around and uh, we'll go from there. So you can see it kind of sits on there. I'm going to mess around with moving moving it around a little bit and uh, try to see where I want it to actually position um, and sit. So I'm going to mess with it a little bit here and I will um, touch base with you when I get it all figured out. And just to note, I don't, I'm hopefully you guys can see this, but you're going to want to take these off these completely off here and I'll sh obviously I'll show you a link on where, to, where I bought them just the universal dirt cheap ones but it comes with a there's two washers on e one on each side which you gotta take off and then there's a metal bracket and then there's this plastic bracket so basically this is gonna go underneath then this is gonna go down then, th then the um, this piece is going to go on top of that and then you put the metal bracket on over top of that and then that's what holds everything down um, so I'm going to do that I just wanted to show you guys exactly how to put this together and I'm going to work on it and I just dropped the washer and there we go front is done now onto the back Which, and I'll do a walk around tomorrow morning to show you exactly what it looks like. Um, it's kinda, I know it's kind of hard here in the dark to uh, show you exactly what it looks like. but um, And you can also, um, I forget what the length of it this is, but I'll look. And you can buy extensions for it um, to extend it out, which I might look into doing that. Because um, right now it's only taking up about half of the truck. And I was thinking about putting a spare tire up there. Um, so we'll see exactly how far I want to go with this thing. Um, <laughs> I was I always do this. Um, I buy a cheap car and I tend to put just can't keep my hands off of it. So uh, we'll see how far I can go with this thing. But um, right now I'm just having fun doing stuff on the cheap side, and um, we'll see. I might try to I might show you exactly what else I got for it. Um, pretty excited about this little thing. So. Having a good time. Here, guys, you can see I got some uh, new wheels and tires for, well, shouldn't say new, new to me. Um, they're really crappy. They're pitted and everything they need cleaned up. Um, but they'll work. Um, the tires on it aren't too bad. They're the same size as the um, ones that are currently on it. The, uh, there's two of them that are really bad. I would say this one is the worst and then the front you could tell these are the front two And then this is another rear one. So I'm gonna eventually have to get new tires for it um, But I got it really cheap. I got it for a hundred bucks these wheels and tires um, So I'm just waiting on a couple other odds and ends stuff and hopefully I'll have all that tomorrow and I can show installing these which I think these are gonna make it um, pretty nice. I think it's gonna sit pretty good and it's just something different i mean they're just uh they're the Krager soft eights so it's just going to give it a little bit more of a four-wheel drive look and then that with the um roof rack and the front brush guard i think it'll really make it look nice and then i'm going to try to get some of this crap off here and uh hopefully that'll all be good and uh i can uh finally then uh try to sell it so yeah guys i think i'm going to end it here you can kind of see you got the roof rack on everything um just kind of dealing with that right now so um and then just kind of show you i did we did get um the car my wife's car currently is in the shop um we had this as a loaner 
nice uh, Dodge Durango um, all-wheel drive. Wife is loving it, so I'm kind of worried. <laughs> but anyway, so we're just doing doing that, and um, I'll try to show a little bit of video in the morning of the uh, roof rack here. So uh, I know it's nothing really too major. It's just a little something, something different. Um, so I got a couple things lined up here, and then the brush guard. I should have the brackets made tomorrow at work, and then tomorrow night I can throw those on along with um, the wheels I just uh, showed you. So I'm gonna hopefully I can all that have all that done, and uh, can keep moving on, and uh, hopefully get this thing uh, flipped around and uh, sell it for some cash, and uh, we'll move on to the next one. So uh, and then also um, the truck that's uh, my daily. I'm um, just kind of have it currently sitting. I've um, got a couple things lined up for that. I'm just kind of waiting, um, trying to talk to uh, this one guy about getting some things done. So we'll see how that goes. And uh, just kind of new to this whole um, this kind of thing. So uh, just bear with me. Um, hopefully I'll have it done here in a week or so, and I can get some better footage of uh, what's in store. So. Uh, well, thank you for uh, watching. Please subscribe and uh, look forward to seeing you on the next one. Bye.